Watching the tide roll away. Windy City too, and uh, oh, yeah. Hi. Hi. gym just worked out here for the morning classes but day two of the two brain summit was great i did have to leave a little bit early because my flight was at like 140 um, but first up i thought it was interesting this guy didn't speak it was his birthday his name is carl and the study guide that i'm using for the level three came from him um, he is a seminar staff uh, trainer out in like sweden and um, i wanted to highlight that because his study guide has really been very helpful Second up, Jolene, she is a mentor. I don't know her personally, but I see her in the Facebook group and um, her mentees are doing really well. She's really, um, really uh, likes SOPs and she's, all these people are just trying to help us share the stories that work for them, right? That uh, they can share with us. Third speaker was uh, that I seen was Andrea Savard. She's out of Canada. Um, I know her personally, um, hung out with her last year at the summit. That's where I met her and actually gave her, her son as a baseball player and was doing online training with him for you know a couple months. Um, she's very, very, has a very big and successful gym. She's always there to help us like answer questions. Very, very nice. And her whole thing, which I can probably take a lesson from is when people are in her gym, she treats them as if they're in her home. Final part before I took off was the awards. They gave, um, last year I won the Lion Award. I'll pop up the picture right here. Um, it's just for perseverance. Like I lost tons of members, right? It was really hard. Um, I could have given up, but I didn't. I stuck with it and I made it through and they wanted to highlight that. Um, this was the mentors who accumulate more than a million dollars in net worth. Um, they get highlighted. So my mentee, Russ, he, he made it up there this year. And it's good because it gives us something to shoot for, right? Like we want to get into the next stage of the mentorship program, which is Tinker. Um, that's when you're accumulating $100,000 or more in owner benefit and you have more time. Um, so once I get there, then hopefully next will lead to that million dollar net worth. I had an absolutely great time at the summit as usual. Um, if you are on the fence about hiring a mentor, it doesn't have to be too brain, but I would, I would do it. You know, there's some people in this world, a good example is my buddy who owns the gym down the street. This guy is the hardest working man I've ever met in my life. And he's had it from the beginning, right? He's been like that. And I've always wondered like, how the hell do you get like that? For me, it took other people believing in me and encouraging me in order for me to find that work ethic. I have it now, right? Nobody can outwork you. We can all work the same amount. There's only 24 hours in the day. So as long as you're working hard, you're keeping up with the next guy. But that's what mentorship has done for me. And it has brought me out of my shell. It has given me the confidence to speak with other business owners because I know my numbers. I'm confident. I see the projection. I see us going up. Um, so if you're on the fence, don't think about it anymore. Just do it. It's worth it. If you can't afford it right now, you will make the money back to pay for it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't. Like the video and we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.